All right, I, I thought that today was another good day. Um, you know, I thought it was you know, a lot of special teams uh, emphasis today. We got hit all four units. Uh, you know, working fundamentals. You know, you know introducing a, you know, a couple different uh, different things. Uh, you know, it's getting still really really excited about what I'm seeing from some of the newcomers. Uh, you know, the continued development from from our vets. Uh, I thought the offense responded well today. Um, you know, it, passing game. Was able to be a little bit more efficient. Had some big plays that showed up. Um, you know, had a couple runs. You know, obviously, once again, you're in the you're in you're in just helmets. It's uh, it's, it's hard to get a real sense of what all that's looking like. But I'm you know just watching the watching the first step. Uh, you know, really like the way the defense is flying around to the ball. I mean, that's you see the depth, you see the competitiveness. Uh, you know, DBs, you know, being active at the catch point. Uh, you know, so I thought it was a really good day. I think specialists are doing a nice job here early in camp, first two days. Uh, like what I'm seeing from them. Uh, you know, trying to get a lot of work with the returners, you know, for uh, those guys, you know, putting in work, putting themselves in the, in the best position um, as they continue to as they continue to compete for that. But um, you know, I thought it was a good day. You guys pass tomorrow? Tomorrow we'll be in we'll be in uppers. We'll be in just shoulder pads, helmets. Um, and so we'll be able to, we'll have that. I guess this is two years now where you're able to be a little more hands on in the summer. Uh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, just the the understanding of you know you're being able to go out and even though you're not going against anybody, just to be able to have formations, alignments, you know, um, be able to run play, you know, throwing on air. Um, it's you know, yesterday we were we had some some inefficiency at times, and we were kind of you know, but uh, t today you saw a quick response to that. And you know, years past, I mean, it would be. A week or so to really when you start seeing timing, but I mean I think the guys understand expectations. Um, you know they and they worked hard and, and, and what we were asking them to do, and then they they went above and beyond on their on their own, and that's where uh, you know you've seen a lot of growth from players. And, you know they're they're uh, confident in what they're being asked to do, and I mean even for the newcomers that are just getting here, uh, it's pretty impressive. Just you know, how they're how they're grasping the information, and you know a lot of. A lot of the freshmen they are having freshman moments, but I mean it's uh, it's impressive seeing them. Uh, you brought in some challenges. Go ahead, I'll stop. <laughs> you brought in some uh, challenges. Uh, yeah, how was Marquise's response? Uh, great. I mean, you I thought Marquise had a really good day today. I mean, had a couple big plays. Um, he's such a big target. I mean, you know, and he's right now he's he's pushing you know 280 pounds, and a run like he runs is is remarkable. And uh, you know, he's got a, he's got a chance to be a really special player. You know, people forget. I played one year of high school football. Uh, you know, was un unable to uh, uh, participate his first year. Um, you know, here and but was around learning, and then you know you you're really seeing him just take off. Um, he's got, he's got a lot of work to do, but I mean it's uh, I think we've got a really really impressive group in that in that room. Um, you know, it's going to give us a lot of versatility and what we can what we can do. It's been a long road back. I know Williams from the ranks, but it seems like he's kind of moving. I mean, it's uh, it, it's great. You know, Winston is somebody you, you want to cheer for for the type of you know, man that he is. Um, you know, he's a great, great player. You know, he's got a wonderful skill set. Um, you see that confidence that's growing, and it's still. I mean, it's it's one of those things. Every day you're pushing to get better. And uh, you know, Winston, so you've had some good plays these first couple of days, and I'm excited to see uh, as this progresses throughout camp. Uh, you know, his he's been able to to be available throughout the entire practice. You know, he's you know, being very smart. You know, with him in some. Uh, in, in, uh, you know, in certain areas, but I mean, he's done he's done a great job. I'm really, really excited about what I'm seeing. Well, I mean, it's it's buy-in, and that's what it, and that's where you know, I, when he came here, you know, we talked about you know, making a complete player. You know, anybody can watch his film and see the highlight plays, and you see the explosiveness, and you know, you know does a lot of good things when 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 he gets the ball. I want that same excitement when he doesn't, and you know, that's a, that's something that we take a lot of pride in within our program. Is uh, you play with and without the ball in your hands, and he is embracing that. Uh, and if that will continue to grow, if he will um, stay on track with that and, and continue to get better, he's got he's got a chance to have a, a very special future in front of him. You, know, you, you sounded excited when you guys found the special bucket. Um, you know, have you seen all of the I'm, I'm, I'm 
very excited about him being a part of this team. I mean, interception today, you know, shows great range, you know, for somebody that has his size and, I mean, ability. I mean, he's still, you know, there's some things that he's going to have to absolutely grow and develop. And, I mean, it's it's every day is going to be a work, work in progress, uh, uh, especially just getting here, you know, this summer. But, man, I'm very excited about the potential that he has, um, you know, and you know, what he's done in, in the first couple of days. How's Kevin settling in there, too? Uh, Kevin's just – I think Kevin's a great player. I mean, you know, his versatility. You see that. You see the confidence as he's gained body weight. He's moving, you know, great. Um, he was un, you know, obviously he, had, uh, he was unavailable this spring due to injury, but uh, you know, he he maximized it you know, every day throughout that. Whether through his rehab process, through you know all the things building for preparing himself for this for this fall uh, camp, and I mean, you know, he he can do so many things for this football team. I think he's going to really going to be special this year. Yeah, I mean, Rob's, Rob's doing really well. I mean, he's ahead of, ahead of schedule on, on all things, and that's why he's been able to participate, you know, fully the uh, last couple of days. Um, you know, we're going to continue to, to, to watch and manage as, as, it, as it goes. Just, but, uh, you know, Rob's played a ton of football here, so, uh, you know, he's doing, doing a really good job. No, absolutely. I mean, he's. Uh, you know, we think we had a special, special, uh, special young man and a special player there. And uh, you know, we're challenging him. We're trying to put him in, in tough and uh, difficult situations, and I mean, he embraces that. And he's got a great attitude. Uh, he's continuing to get better. Uh, I think he's going to you know, really help us. Yeah, I mean, Thomas is Thomas is working. I mean, he had to overcome. You know. Really a devastating injury when he when he got hurt, um, and it's, it's been a it's been a work in progress. But I mean, he's he stuck after it, and continuing to uh, to push and get better. You know, looking forward to what, what he's going to be able to do as we uh, as we continue through fall camp. Coach, Daniel opened up their practice today, and I had asked Coach about um, what it means for the city of Tallahassee to have someone like Tim over the program. He gave you a lot of credit. He just said that Tallahassee is the best football city in the country. What do you think about that? What, how cool is it to have both? Uh, it's uh, it's great, and uh, yeah, I talked to Coach Simmons this weekend before we uh, uh, before we got going, and we spent about 15, 15 minutes on the phone just you know, talking about different things we're doing, different things they're doing. Just uh, um, he's a great leader. Uh, you know, he cares about his cares about his players. You know, develops coaches. I mean, he's just uh, I'm excited about what they're going to be able to accomplish this year. And um, you know, it is it, it's a it's great when you have you know two universities that are uh, are going to compete at a high level and, and represent Tallahassee the way you know deserves to be represented. So uh, you're definitely you know, cheering him along as, uh, as, they, as they start off uh, this season as well. All right, guys, thank you. Thanks, Mike.